hey guys so in this video we will going to teach you how you guys can set up the crossover for mac okay so basically crossover will going to help you to run the windows application especially crossover is designed for games okay so if you want to play games especially windows games on your mac okay so this crossover is the right solution for you okay so let's see you can see now on my screen that you can just open the browser and you can just type this url my-link.in slash crossover i will also going to attach the link below in this video description or in this video's lesson okay so just go to the video description of this video and click on this link okay or you can just type everything in small my dash link dot in slash crossover click on enter button and then you guys will go to the store okay so from here you can see that we have only two pricing plans first is the free okay but it will not going to give you any solution for some bugs and uh, all types of that okay so you basically left with the crossover plus version or crossover lifetime plan so uh, basically it's an annual plan okay so so you can see uh, in my case it's you know dollar 24 when i'm recording the lecture so in future it may increase or decrease also it depends upon the country from where you are opening the website okay so let's just go ahead and grab any one of the deal so basically you have two plans crossover plus or crossover lifetime plan so this is annual plan as i have mentioned and this is a lifetime plan once you pay and then forever you can use the tool with the lifetime uh, support as well okay the only two things you will going to get or i can say three things you will going to get is that unlimited email and support okay for lifetime you will going to get upgrades and bugs fixes for lifetime along with that you will also going to get the warm fuzzy feeling of supporting wine okay so basically wine is a kind of uh, you know tool that helps to convert windows to mac okay so you can just join the community in case if you want to help them okay another is the uh, basically their swag uh, it includes you know kind of their t-shirts uh, and so on so all these things are here okay so that's the only difference okay so you can choose any one of the plan for example i can just go with let's say this uh, crossover plus plan okay so you can even go with the lifetime plan okay uh, you will going to support the community of cross crossover okay so let's just purchase any one of the plan for example this plan okay and you can see this is how you can just pay you uh, in case you if you don't have your account so you will see the option to create one account here okay so in my case it's done i will just set up the first name last name and make sure you put the email address correctly okay your zip code and all these details you just have to put okay and after uh, and after you will going to do this you just have to put your card details number also you can just go ahead with the paypal option as well okay or credit card okay so you can just go with any one of the uh, option just put the informations and then you have to click on this checkout button okay you can see after you will just going to click on checkout so you can say thank you for the order you basically have purchased your order okay and after you will going to do this also in your email you can just confirm that you will going to receive the email of thank you purchase okay like the confirmation of the order okay like that okay so that's amazing right so after you will going to do this you will see this my order page by the way okay so you can just come to your my account in case if you don't see it here so you can just uh, come from you know here my account okay from your profile and just go to the downloads okay and from here you guys will going to see the download option just click on this download one okay so compress the file okay after downloading if not automatically unpress okay so just download this okay download this version so i can see okay so now i can see that it is now downloading from here so just tap here and this will going to get downloaded okay so just click here it will 
so just click here okay and then you will see it will going to start to download here so just wait for it to get downloaded so now you guys can see crossover is downloaded now i can just go to the finder just go to downloads okay this is the crossover downloaded let's open this double tap okay and that's how the crossover looks like you can just drag it to application here so it will just going to move to you know your application uh it's here only let me just see okay so it's here okay you can also launch it from you know uh your launch pad so let's uh open this crossover let's open this okay unlock with the purchase information now uh, whatever email id and password you use uh, while you know creating the account in the crossover you just have to put that email id and password here and automatically your license will be you know unlocked okay so it's very uh, easy by the way okay so in case if you uh, don't know about your password so you can just reset the password okay just log out just use that same email id and just reset it and then you can uh, do that but uh, i guess you have just now created the account so you will remember your email and password okay so just put the same email id and password you use while creating the account or while you are while you were purchasing uh, okay so at that time you have created the account so same email and password you have to put okay uh, then automatically it will be unlocked so you can see this copy is now fully enabled okay awesome so you can see that we have finally uh, got here uh, the crossover open okay so from you can just open the install and from here you guys can just search for you know uh, steam okay uh, if you want to so you can just search for the steam okay and from the steam you can you know basically install the steam from here okay so you can see the complete detail so just click on the install and then you can see it will automatically going to create the bottle for you and it will just going to ask permission allow it okay so automatically it will just going to download this uh, steam for you okay so make sure just you just click on yes it is just downloading okay so just have patience you don't have to do anything here it will automatically going to do the tax for you click on next choose your language you can just choose the folder let's install it awesome you can see run steam finish okay almost done almost done and we are here okay so it's just extracting the packages so basically you just have to you know don't do anything let's wait for it to complete the task okay so after you will going to do this you can see the steam is ready you can just open the steam awesome like this and you can see at the back you have the steam account so uh, in case if you don't have account you can just create a free account here okay and after you will going to create a free account uh, just choose uh, all these uh, stuffs okay from uh, here but i already have account and in case if you want to learn about how to use steam and all so we have one uh, free tutorial as well so you can just search for cuckoo courses okay uh, we will also going to attach the link below we have one free course okay so that will just going to give you the enough knowledge for each and everything okay so just uh, come to this website just crawl at the very bottom click on free courses okay so this is our own website by the way from here just search for mac and then you will going to see mac gaming editing and so on it's totally free course okay so just see lot of good informations more will be you know uh, coming in future so just click on the start learning button and after you will going to do this so 
the video which you are watching right now is here games with crossover but of course if you want to learn about steam okay so just click on the steam setup okay for games so from here you can just learn more about the steam okay so just wait for the video player to get uh, load it for you but uh, when you will going to use crossover so at that time automatically it will just going to download the steam version so you don't have to manually uh, install the steam from uh, the website okay uh, it just uh, for your knowledge okay so like if you want to create account and if you want to see how steam looks like uh, and where to go and all so for that this particular lecture is made okay so you can just click on this play button yes, first. okay and then you can just watch it up but it is that simple by the way okay so i will also going to attach the attach this course link okay in the uh, below video section and from there you guys can also come and watch this particular uh, course okay and also if you will just go to let's say game status reviews and so from here you can see check game status review and guide click on here button okay so basically here we will going to provide you whatever games we will going to play okay with crossover and all so you can see complete detail for example uh you know you can see uh, we have you know battlefield 4 uh, we have not yet updated it properly but when you will going to come here again so at that time everything will be updated okay so here the it is battlefield 4 so here we just give the information about uh, on which uh, this game worked okay so uh, this game worked in the parallel okay and in crossover we have not yet tested but it will not going to work we know that but in parallel if you want to play this battle uh, field 4 game so just watch this video you can see the complete details in this particular sheet okay so this is what i just want to tell you so make sure you just go ahead and uh, put your username okay and password for your steam account okay after you will do this just click on the sign in button okay you are just trying in the offline mode uh, okay so let, let's just try it again mm, it's taking because i guess my net is you know a bit slow that's the reason uh, everything is working very slow okay let, let me just retry it okay so now it will just going to send the code okay you just uh, have to go to your email of your steam account okay and in that email they will going to provide you the code in my case they have provided you this code for me but in your case uh, the code will be different and you can see that uh, when steam will going to send you the email okay so just verify that code with the steam and you will going to see the steam will going to open for you and from here you guys can see the steam and if you let's say have purchased the game with the steam so here you can just see the complete details about your steam and all okay so that's how the steam looks like you can see over here you can just move it here and there and you can just uh, close this up okay so basically in your you know library uh, you can just go ahead and see the games which you can play okay so that's how basically you guys can see that's how we can just set up the crossover and automatically it will going to set up the steam for you and from here you can just download the games which is supported on crossover and you can play the games okay so it's somehow that simple let me just cross it okay so for example if you want to play let's say gta so you can just go ahead to gta just install the game make sure you have proper store uh, storage on your mac just install it and you can play the any supported games with crossover very easily using this method okay and guys uh, before we end one more uh, thing uh, you can basically first of all go here okay to the steam okay and just exit it okay so it's you know shutting down your steam properly 
um, so if you just come here here to the crossover you can just go to the you know steam and from here uh, you can first of all switch on this e-sync okay so it will just going to synchronize all your events okay so let's just turn it on awesome and the another one is you can see d3d metal and dxvk okay so basically first is uh, using you know uh, this setting use the apple gaming toolkit so if you remember that apple has launched their gaming toolkit okay which is a very powerful layer okay so uh, in majority of the games if you just enable this so this will going to work uh, best okay and you can also try with you know dyvk okay so it's a back and forth d3 d11 okay but uh, uh, you can just try uh, with both of them in which it will going to work best but uh, generally case this d3d metal basically works the best for the majority of games okay so you can just turn this uh, setting on so just make sure that you just cross it okay and shut uh, shut down your crossover completely and then you can just restart your crossover from here and make sure that all the settings which you have done is now 100% ready okay so this is all I just wanted to teach you about the crossover setup okay to uh, basically run the Windows uh, applications especially games on your Mac okay